ever heard of Alexa or Siri? Have you ever seen a self-driving car? Have you ever wondered how iPhone's face recognition works? All of these technologies have something in common. They use artificial intelligence or AI. My name is Maddie and I'm on the team at Inspirit AI. Inspirit AI offers interdisciplinary, project-based artificial intelligence courses for K-12 students, all developed by Stanford and MIT graduates. In today's video, I'm going to be answering the question, what is AI for kids? Artificial intelligence, or AI, is the ability for a computer to think and learn. With AI, computers can perform tasks that are typically done by people, including processing language, problem solving, and learning. Artificial intelligence is a tool much like other types of technologies. We've already shared a couple of examples of how AI is used, like virtual assistants and self-driving cars, but AI is actually used in the world around us every single day. Let's take a look at a couple of examples. If you've ever streamed a movie on Netflix, for example, you may have noticed that you will receive recommendations for other movies based on what you've watched already. That's because of AI. Many websites also have chatbots that help answer your questions. These chatbots are not typically run by people. They're actually AI. Most people also use search engines like Google every single day. I know I do, and search engines use AI to rank websites in your search results. What other examples of AI come to mind? Once you start to recognize AI in your everyday life, you'll start to realize that it is everywhere. AI is all around us whether or not you realize it. And even though AI is used today, many computer scientists predict that AI is going to have an even bigger presence in the future. This is already true of many professions today. Doctors use AI to diagnose patients based on medical scans like x-rays. And astronauts can use AI models to detect exoplanets, or planets outside of our solar system. And these are just a couple of examples. As a kid, you might not be quite sure what you want to be when you grow up yet. Either way, there's a pretty good chance that artificial intelligence is going to be connected to your future job. At Inspirit AI, we have instructors who use AI as artists, as scientists, and even as fashion designers. Artificial intelligence really will have application for every single job in the future. In addition to using AI in a future job, kids can also talk about how people can use and train AI to make a difference. By learning about AI from an early age, kids are able to gain a better understanding of how we can use this tool to improve our world. But how exactly can kids get started programming AI? The most important step in learning about AI is learning how to code. Learning how to code is an essential skill for kids and adults to have. At Inspirit AI, we recommend that kids get started by using a block-based programming tool like Scratch. Scratch is a really user-friendly block-based programming tool that's great for beginners. With Scratch, students can code their own animation, stories, and even video games. Scratch is so much fun and it's a really great tool to use to get started with programming. That's why we use Scratch in our AI adventures and AI creators courses for elementary and early middle school students. Inspirit AI offers interdisciplinary, project-based artificial intelligence courses for K-12 students developed and taught by Stanford and MIT graduates. Thousands of students from over 70 countries have participated in our online programs, and you can too. In our classes, you'll learn how to code your own AI projects, games, and more. Be sure to check out the link in the video description down below to learn more about Inspirit AI and apply for our ongoing programs. Thanks so much for watching today's video all about what AI is for kids. If you liked this video, be sure to give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our Inspirit AI YouTube channel, and we'll see you back here soon. Bye.